Hi, this is Julie with Beataholic, and today I want to show you how to finish memory wire. So here I have a memory wire bracelet, and what's great about it is it retains its shape. So you can see it's got this wonderful coil shape to it, and all you need to do to create a bracelet with it is to finish off the ends. So here is some memory wire without beads, and it just has that nice coil shape. And I'm going to show you three different ways that you can finish your ends after you've added all your beads. So the first way, and probably the easiest, is to just make a little loop at the end of your memory wire. So I've got some wire looping pliers here. I'm just going to put the wire in it and twist around. And there we go, we have a loop. And that will secure your beads from falling off, and then you have something that you can add a little dangle to. So that's one way. Another way is with these little crimp beads that have a loop already attached. So I'm going to do that on another end. So to work with these, what you're going to do is go ahead, just pop it on there, take your crimping pliers. Now we're not going to want to crimp up near the loop because you run the risk of actually hurting the loop itself. So what you're going to want to do is just crimp down at the bottom. And you're just going to crimp like any other crimp bead. And there you go, and that's going to stay on there securely. So the third and final way I want to show you, and this way looks very clean, is using one of these little end caps. And it's got a little hole in it on one side, and then it's a nice round ball. And to apply these, you're going to take some GS Hypo Cement. We're going to put it on the wire itself. Just going to take one of these little guys, find the hole, and press onto place, and then we're just going to let that dry, and it's going to dry and be solid. So those are three separate options on how you can finish memory wire, and it will allow you to make a great piece of memory wire jewelry.